fucking great. Draw into bottom of the league at Burnley. Guys, this is Mr. Joshy J and Manchester United have drawn 1-1 away at Turf Moor to Burnley in the Premier League. What can I say? Absolutely shambolic. I mean, in the first half, we should have had the game wrapped up, really, just like we did against Middlesbrough. Second half, nowhere near good enough. I'm sorry. Against bottom of the league at Burnley, this is unfucking acceptable. Now, last night, I did a 60 seconds rant because I was in no mood to do a full rant. But today, I'm doing my usual full rant. Now, some fans may have gone beyond ranting and raving, but, you know, I'm still going to rant, because I'm furious, you know. This is not funny anymore. This is absolutely getting more depressing by the second. It really is. Every second, this is getting more depressing. We are absolutely done as a top elite level football club. We are just a bang average mid-table side. I mean, Harry Maguire last night, fuck me, one of the worst games he ever had in the Manchester United shirt. Why do you think I call him Captain Twat? Because he is. He's just absolutely fucking useless. 80 million worth of shite. And as Flying Pig United says, we need to flush it down the drain. Dear me, bruh. What more does he have to do to keep getting himself yellow carded? Because he's earned a few yellow cards as well this season. Just simply, I've had enough of Harry Maguire now. I've just had enough of him. He needs to do one. I mean, why not play Hector Lindelof and Raphael Moran together? To me, it's a much better partnership than keep playing Captain Twat all the time. So had enough of him. Slabhead Maguire. Good at scoring headers for England, so I can never fucking score headers for us, can you? Dear me. Absolute joke. I'm sorry. Bottom of the league, Burnley, and we draw. And some fans think, oh, top four's on. We're not too far behind. We're only a point behind West Ham. Yes, we got a game in hand during the West Ham, but look at Tottenham. They got about fucking three or four games in hand. So, yeah, we're not getting in top four because look at our fixtures in March, you know. Chelsea, Man City, Arsenal, Tottenham, all the top teams in March. If you think we're getting top four, I'm sorry, you are absolutely deluded. There's no fucking chance. We're getting top four, honestly. But, you know, it's shocking. It really is. I just, I'm so had enough in this season. It's been a total write off in the season. I mean, would we have been better off to keep Oli Gunnar Solskjaer on as manager? Because what's changed? What has fucking changed? Ralph Raniak's came in, nicknamed the German professor. And we're meant to be playing high pressing football, and there's been absolutely none of it. I mean, German professor, how about the German? I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Because with these group of players, he just has no idea what he's doing, Ralph Ranyak. Now, I'm not saying he's all to blame in that, but I'm noticing a couple of mistakes by Ralph Ranyak. I mean, dropping Ronaldo to the bench, you know. I was furious when Oli drops Ronaldo to the bench, and I was very critical. Now I'm going to criticise Ralph Raniak for doing the same. I know he had a shit game against Middlesbrough, but come on, man. You do not leave your star player on the bench. He's literally... I know his form's a bit shit recently, but he's still one of our top players. If it wasn't for him, we'll be out in the Champions League right now. I mean, dear me, dropping him to the bench, fucking joke. What the fuck are you thinking about, Ralph Raniak? German professor, more like, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Oh, dear me, really winds me up. I'm so just, I'm getting more depressed by the second. I mean, you may say I'm ranting and raving, believe it or not, I, 
I could think of shit about the views. I'm just uh, ranting and raving away because I'm pissed off, you know. I'm passionate. I don't do these videos just for clicks and views. I'm not like the big YouTubers who are going to react or anything. Straight facts. On this channel, you get straight facts. And I was saying it how it is. I mean, I criticise Dolly and... Uh, you got to criticise Ralph Raniak for leaving like Ronaldo on the bench. Just, man, what the fuck is going on with my beautiful football club this season? It's not even funny. Like I said, it's just getting more and more depressing by the minute. And Ronaldo, if we don't make it Champions League, it'll be gone. It's as simple as that. It'll be fucking gone. Yep. But... As in the player ratings, unfortunately, I didn't see the game. My I only saw brief highlights, so I'm not going to do full player ratings. But, you know, Rashford has been off form. But I like him playing on the left-hand wing because he looks a bit more sharper on the left-hand wing. Paul Pogba, you know, from that Thunderbolt goal. You know, he'll probably get a 7 or an 8 and probably my man of match as well. I mean, Bruno again, fucking mouthing off on the referee. Stop mouthing off on the referee. Do your fucking job out on the pitch. Seriously, bruv. I've had enough of Bruno Fernandes. Keep constantly going on at the referee all the fucking time. Oh, just... I don't know what else to say. I'm running out of words, you know. I mean... I'm having a rant because I'm so annoyed. I'm frustrated. I'm tired of it. I'm bored. You know, all I want us to do is still be a top elite level football club. But, nope, we're finished. We're just a bang average mid-table side. And that's a harsh reality, is it? But, you know, you criticised Dolly when he made errors. Now you've got to do the same to Ralph Ranyak. I mean, but like I said, I'm not blaming it all on him because these players who we got out on the pitch should fucking be ashamed of themselves. And a lot of them, if I was manager, they'll be fucking put on the transfer market. Just on this big money thinking, oh, we're on big money. We don't have to perform. We're playing for one of the biggest football clubs in the world, Manchester United. Fuck off. Do your bloody job out on the pitch, all you. Show you owe it to the fans. Show why you want to be a Manchester United player. Fight for the badge. Show you're angry. Like the red devil on the shirt. Ah, oh, it's got to be said. You know, I'm sorry if I'm getting me worked up about it. But like I said, I'm passionate. There's no scripting bullshit here. I'm literally just saying it how it is. And just... Revealing how I'm feeling, because, you know, like I said, it's just getting depressing by the minute. When you got all these fuckers on all this big money, and they're just not performing. They need to get the fuck out of this beautiful football club, bruh. Seriously, just get out of here. Sort yourselves out, or fuck off. It's as simple as that. Done. Comment your thoughts down below, I will always reply. Like I say, I make no apologies for ranting.